Hi all. It's 1.45. Um, I just want to do this before I shoot off to bed. I don't know why lately I've been going to bed at like 2 o'clock in the morning and waking up at like 8.30, well anywhere between 8.30 and 9.30. And I really don't know why, but uh, it's all changed there up this corner already, look. Bookcases have been uh, dismantled. And um, I'm going to look to you guys for a suggestion because I can't actually make up my mind. Because uh, <laughs> I'm going to convert all of this into the new desk. I don't know whether to just put the desk in this corner, you know, from this end to the wall. Or to do what my brother suggested. Uh. Pardon me. And... Uh, do the L shape. Um, the L shape would give me that extra bit of desk, but I'm not sure I actually need it. Um, and that would actually mean extra work of putting the battens in on the walls to support the top, which I'm going to make out of um, these uprights from the old bookcase. Um, I've got some extra boards if we need them in the bedroom as well. But my other idea was, was, uh, sorry Nemo, because the actual top is going to be two boards like that put together, but these two uprights, right, side by side, um, so which means when I make, like, the cabinet to go this end with the shelves in, I'd have to use two of the or four of those so I could make up two like that and what I'll do I'll use these shelves to hold these panels together so I'll lay these on the floor I'll screw the plastic blocks in that I'm going to use to support the shelf and then screw the shelf to the plastic blocks um, so basically using the shelf to hold those together uh, and I'll need to make two of those, but I've only got enough of these to do one in black. But in the bedroom, I've got two other boards that I can use to make that end and just paint them black. Because I've got a tin of um, a tin of black paint in my cupboard. Actually, I've got two tins, I think. Yeah, two tins. So, uh... What do you guys think? L-shaped table or just a straight table? Um, either way, possibly tomorrow, I've got a shelf to put up on that wall. Just because it's going to be easier to do it now while the desk isn't there than it will be with the desk there and everything on it. Um, and if you're wondering where everything went from the bookcases, well they sort of went there, there, over there. At least that's where the Lego went and all the other stuff has gone in the bedroom. <laughs> uh, it's where he likes to sleep at night. Usually on the end of my bed, but lately he's been stealing my computer chair at night. Anyway, the other thing I've been doing, aside from playing GTA, is uh, Spraying up bike frames. I've sprayed this one, which was already black. I've just uh, given it a couple of coats just to freshen it up a bit because it was rather scratched and marked. And that one, which was white, which also had a shit paint job, I've gone over with black. Got these white forks in it, got some wheels in it. I've got to put tubes in the wheels, but I don't know if any of these tubes are punctured yet. And I've also got this racing frame that I want to build up into a racing bike and uh, all three of these will be put up for sale when they're done um, <clears throat> I've also got another Claude Butler mountain bike sitting in my mum's garden which if I'm going to get all three of these built up I'll be keeping instead of selling and it cost me five pounds from um, Biggles 
mum and stepdad's old neighbour, so because he still goes down the dump and picks up bikes and whatnot. I haven't been for absolutely ages because <laughs> uh, it's not on the way to mum's anymore now that she's moved. And if you wonder what I'm doing, I'm undoing my bootlaces because uh, I've got an itchy foot. And why is it every time I've got an itchy foot, these bootlaces are a pain in the ass to friggin' undo? I've got the bloody. I've fucking knotted them. <laughs> oh. There we go, I've got it. Poxy things. Right, there's one. Yeah, for some reason my psoriasis has been a bitch lately as well and decided to uh, drive me up the wall with itching, especially always at night when I go to bed as well, when I take my boots off or whatever, you know, and I get get the clothes off and I get into bed, then everything starts bloody itching. So I spend about half an hour scratching myself to death. Um, but yeah, this is a nice clawed butler. Needs a front wheel, which I've got. I've got a bunch of wheels for um, the other two bike frames here uh, out on the landing ready. Well, uh, I figured I needed the wheels and I needed a bit of a sort out in the outside cupboard anyway, so I thought I might as well just get the wheels I needed out ready so I've got the wheels out for all three of these bikes and the front wheel I need for the bike at mum's the only reason it's over at mum's is because she brought me home last night and she won't allow anything like that to be put in the brand new car which I don't blame her you know I probably wouldn't either if it was my car <laughs> You know, I'd have an old jalopy runabout for things like that, which is why they've kept the um, the um, four before. My stepdad's got that. Cool. Here we go. Itchy, itchy everywhere. Right. So. What I've got planned for tomorrow is uh, doing as much work to these bikes as possible. I might have to get some cables Thursday because um, I've only got used cables and none of them are long enough to go to the rear gears. So I'll at least need gear cables. Brake cables, no. Uh, Unless I need some hours, I might need some hours because I don't know if I've got anything long enough yet. Shouldn't, shouldn't need them. Dralias and things, I should have all of those. Not, shouldn't be an issue on either of them. I hope not, anyway. I was going to... Gonna stuff me if I um, haven't got the dralias. Mind you, I've got two boxes: one for front dralia max and one for rear. I'm sure I'll be able to find something in there. All right, seat posts. Got those. Got handlebars. Got those out on the landing as well. Ow! It actually feels like something's bitten me on my ankle. I hope I haven't friggin' got bought fleas in at the flat. Right. Oh. Now, next, go over to Mum's. I've got to take these cables. Now, if you look at that. If you're wondering what I did then, I completely cocked up. I was showing it at the um, screen, forgetting that the camera bit is over here. But yeah, my brother's got a set of speakers, and he's got one of these, but it's a stereo jack. So the speaker he's trying to run isn't working properly. And I actually said he needed one of these, you know, with the just the two connections, the mono. Um, so I've got a couple of cables down there. Ouch. 
that should solve the problem and saying I'll bring one over for ages and uh, I was tucking some things under my bed here and I found my box of cable and went through them because I knew I had some and uh, found those up so I'll take those out next time I go over and he'll have good working speakers because it's only to go to another speaker a single speaker so it doesn't need to be stereo and because of the connections on the stereo plug it's not working right he couldn't figure it out at first why but uh, that's why I just took one look and I was like yep that's why someone's using the wrong cable they've made one up from something else so it shouldn't take me long to put these bikes together let's hope I've got enough chains in my box to do all three otherwise I'm going to be stuffed there as well <laughs> uh, That's all the VHS tapes I've got left. I binned the most of them, so I just didn't watch them. These are the only one. These are the ones I can't bring myself to chuck. So I've kept those ones, and pretty much the rest just went straight in the bin. Because <laughs> a lot of it, I can get it online. I could download it so easily online if I really wanted to. So I really didn't see the point. Or stick it down there then, I don't care. No, don't you dare go falling through there. I'm not fishing you out of there at this time of night. Oh, I have. Something has bitten me on the friggin' ankle. Friggin' bug bikes. Bug, bug bikes. Bug bites rather, not bug bikes. Clearing the bed off. Oh, I'm gonna turn the PS3 off. That can go off now. Turn off the system. Yep. Switch off the TV as well. Whew. All right. Vacuum these floors and I still my feet still find sharp objects. You alright stand there, Nemo. I'm just gonna shut the PC down. French friend. There we go. Close all that. Power and shut down. Number of times I've clicked restart by accident. Really? <laughs> right, anyway, I'm going to leave it at that. That's what I've been up to today. Or yesterday, I should say. Um, what's this? It's a bit of Lego. Uh, Probably work on bikes tomorrow. Yay. <laughs> uh, actually, speaking of, I did, yeah, I did lock everything up in the shed. I had my Claude Butler out, and I do not want to leave that one outside. All right. Still got to get a belt for this. 
the only reason why the um, record deck won't work. The belt was gone. The belt had totally gone. Actually, the belt had disintegrated and turned into a sticky goo. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to leave it at that and I'll get this uploaded at some point tomorrow while I'm working on bikes. So the chances are, well, at least those in the, that live in the UK that subscribe to me will uh, um, see the video probably while I'm still working on bikes. Well, anyway, thanks a lot for watching. And I will talk to you again in the next video. Bye.